Now, chances are you remember a small little crime caper released a few years back starring George Clooney. It was called Ocean's Eleven and it oozed a sense of glamour and a great sense of fun from absolutely every pore. Well, gunning for the same vibe is Bruce Willis's new film called Red, although it don't expect to be quite so excited with the result. They used to be the CIA's top agents. Victoria, best wet work asset in the business. What? What's that? I kill people, dear. But the secrets they know... This is off the books, total blackout. ...just made them... the agency's top targets. Tell me everything you know. Some thumbsucker tagged him red. Red? Retired, extremely dangerous. Based on the comic book, the film sees Brucey play for retired black ops man Frank Moses, who, when he's targeted for assassination, goes on the run with his old but equally badass pals, played by Helen Mirren and Morgan Freeman. What do you suppose the punishment is for what we're doing here? Death. Now, while this is certainly a slick and good-looking film, that can't disguise the fact that there are major problems with the plot. Namely, who's chasing Frank, why are they chasing Frank, and should we be on their side or Frank's? Overall, I'm afraid this is a bit of a disappointment. Although the title refers to the expression retired and extremely dangerous, the film itself feels retrograde and exceptionally dull. So, two.